To create a new Google Form, go to New, scroll down to More, and click on Google Forms. First thing you want to do is go ahead and title your form. Notice right now it says Untitled Form here and Untitled Form here. You want to rename your form up top here. We're going to call this Survey 1 and click OK. Now you'll notice it also changed our name right here. But here's an important thing to know. If you come in here and now change this name again, notice when I click Done, it will not change the name of my document. So just know that these two items are separate once you name your file. You have the option here to show progress bar at the bottom of form pages. This option only works if your form is more than one page long. This is an advanced feature we'll talk about later. Right here you'll see the title of the form. You can change this at any time. Underneath is where you have form description. This is where you can write additional information or directions to your viewers of your form. We'll go over each of the things within Google Forms in more detail on the, on the other slides and in videos, but I'm just going to give a little brief overview of what you see here. A few options to be aware of at the top are the edit questions. Click here to change your theme. We're going to cover that in another tutorial. You would click here to view the responses to see what people have actually typed into your Google Form. Here's where you would go to see what your live form looks like to your viewers. When you're ready to get the link, it would be send a form up here. And then here are all the area for the questions to add additional questions. But again, we're going to review that in another video. Just wanted to give you a quick overview on what you're going to see coming up.